Rules give you the ability to route events that arrive on an event bus. Each event is evaluated against a set of rules. If the event matches, then EventBridge routes the event accordingly. In the EventBridge console, you can see any existing rules from the Rules option in the left-hand sub-menu. Only rules with the status of Enabled are used. There are different types of rules. Standard and scheduled are created by AWS customers, while managed rules are created and owned by the EventBridge service. Each rule must have a name. The rule match is based upon an event pattern or a schedule. Event patterns match against JSON attributes in the incoming events. In this example, the defined pattern matches events with a source of my application and detail type of orders, and a nested attribute called event name, which can have one of three different values. Events that match on schedules use a cron-like syntax and run on a defined interval. Schedule-based rules can be used to run cron jobs every day or every few minutes, for example. A single rule can only apply to a single event bus. A rule can have up to five targets. These are services or endpoints that matching events are sent to. For example, you can configure a matching event to be routed to a Lambda function, an SNS topic, or an SQS queue for further processing. This allows you to build event-driven applications where you can perform custom logic when specified events occur. If you have more than one target, the event is sent to the targets in parallel. If the event is not delivered successfully to the target, EventBridge retries for up to 24 hours. You can have up to 300 rules per AWS account per region, which can be increased upon request. For more resources on learning about events, go to s12d.com forward slash about events.